Good afternoon everyone and welcome to a little weapon video from Bloodborne the Old Hunters DLC. Now the weapon I've got here is the Boom Hammer which is one of the new uh, trick weapons available in the DLC and look it's a giant hammer that you can hit with a flint and it does well this, this is a charge R2 attack. Boom! <laughs> it's not called the Boom Hammer for nothing. Uh, I thought I'd do a little video just showing off the kind of the moveset I had. Uh, this was while I was doing a bit of farming and Generally, wait. I was waiting for an NPC summon. Actually, uh, sorry, not an NPC summon. Another player summon. So I was bored, sitting around, and I decided to wail on these guys on the bridge. And this weapon is fantastic. At this point, it's level plus five. Um, it also has a blood gem in, which ups the fire damage on it. Which is why, when it's not tricked, it's doing fire damage. It doesn't normally do that. Now, this weapon is best used when you have a lot of stamina. Because as you can see, comboing with it, while effective and damaging, destroys your stamina bar. Especially if you're going for the Charge R2 attack. However, there is a benefit to the Charge R2 attack. And it's these two blood lickers here whose AI path seems to have fucked up. Watch this. Oh, knocks them both over. Really handy for dispersing groups of enemies if you can get the timing right. So then I take on this guy. Knock him down, take nearly all of his health off, and avoid the delayed Molotov. So we come down here, whack him, and he's dead. So now we now we decide to have a bit of a play with these blood like uh, blood lickers. Now what what's this? Get that and knock them both out. That does about 300 damage to both of them, which is really handy because when you tricked it and you do that um, over the top R2 attack, the charge attack, you can get area of effect, so you can really whack them. Now at this point one of the blood lickers gets stuck in the environment, so I decide to wail on him. <laughs> I don't like fighting the blood lickers, they are one of the most difficult enemies really to fight because they can't be staggered and they just attack you so ferociously. Very easy to get combo to death by them. So at this point I'm playing a bit of um, bait and attack with the blood licker, blood licker that isn't stuck in the environment. So charge the weapon, Boom! Knock him over. I do this a couple of times and it's a really effective way of fighting him. Because you just wait till the de aggro, which is really quick actually. Because they'll just go back to their normal path. And then you can go in and you can whack them. Although you want to be careful to avoid being caught by their spit attack. Which is only in the old hunters actually. They don't do this when you fight them in Canehurst. Mostly because there's no blood for them to suck up. At that point I missed. So... For, it to, for the area of effect to work, you actually have to connect with a, a target. You can't just kind of blindly hit in the middle of something. You have to hit one of them, and then if something is stood close next to them, then they'll get knocked over by the AoE. So come around here, get that. And I hit him, and he's dead. And he's splattered. I'm try and take on this one and almost get killed by this one. I don't know, almost get killed. There is a point where later when I try on it, I almost get killed. So we're going to move up to here. I'm going to do a drop attack. This is fun. Watch this. It's flat. <laughs> now I caught him actually as he was moving back. He did about 350 damage to him. Um, I think I just like to try and do it again. Or, no, I switched back to my sword cleaver, I think. Because I want to compare the damage. He's got 350 damage with the... Um, with the hammer. And with the sword cleaver. Just over 400. On a drop attack, and then I try one more, which is to do the sword cleaver open attack uh, with it tricked. With that, and it's less. And I don't know why that is, possibly because the blade is in the serrated on the back end of it. Uh, but that's also a plus nine weapon. No, it's a plus eight weapon, rather. So, yeah, that's a little bit of the boom hammer move set for you. Uh, if you enjoyed this, please leave a like and subscribe. Let me know if you do like this kind of video, and I'll do more on the new Hunter's weapons as I find them. But now, though, thank you for watching, and good night.